Hi y'all, my name is Carissa. This is the Fat Girl Flow channel and today we are trying on outerwear from Snow Country Outerwear. Today is the first day that it has been under like 95 degrees in several weeks. So I woke up and I was like, okay, I think it's cool enough in the house to try on snow outerwear. Uh, but I am still glistening. I am still sweating. Uh, because it's not exactly cool in here even though it's not exactly sweltering so snow country outerwear was one of our sponsors at fat camp this year they sponsored a $400 gift card that we raffled off during our pool party one of our fat campers won it I'm really excited to do this haul because now I can show that fat camper how everything fits and they can go on their big shopping spree trying on these clothes was more fun than I thought it would be for me. My sister is a snowboarder. She lives in the Northwest and is on a mountain almost all the time when there's snow on the ground. Uh, she loves winter sports and I am a summer baby. I really prefer to not even go in the snow or at least I thought that was my perspective. I have learned over the last many years that I actually really, really love the snow. The problem that I faced constantly was that I just couldn't find clothes that I could wear out in the snow. I nev I've i never owned like bibs or even a jacket that fit me well enough that I could like zip it up and run around and put a sweater under it and stuff. So. Trying on all of these in the sizes that actually fit me was like being a kid again. It really was. There were moments where I had to run over to Jay and show them how cute I looked in all of my snow gear. <laughs> I love it. I'm a ski bunny. <laughs> And I feel really excited about the possibility of kind of changing my attitude around snow stuff. Uh, if you were to ask my sister, she knows she invites me every year and wants me to come do snow stuff with her and I say no. And I really feel like, okay, look, I'm outfitted. Maybe I could actually be in the snow and not be miserable and not have to wear just like a big sweater in the snow. So this was... This was just a really good experience trying all of these on and realizing that there are things that can fit me, that can get me outside when it's snowing, and that I can continue to enjoy the outdoors even when it's cold outside. Along with this video, I have also written a blog post about Snow Country outerwear and everything that they offer. I'm going to mostly just tell you like how the fit is and everything in this video. If you're a person who likes to spend a lot of time outdoors and you ski, or you do a lot of winter sports or anything like that, I am sure you're just as interested in the technical aspects of all of the outerwear. And that includes like lining on the inside, pockets on the inside, all of those fun things. And I am going to talk more about that in my blog post. This is going to be more about how the fit is and what I think of the styles and everything. But you can check out the blog post. It's linked down below and learn all about the technical aspects of the pieces and what Snow Country Outerwear offers. Okay, I'm going to start with the bibs. Uh, if you don't know what bibs are, bibs are just another word for like overalls, for ski pants, for anything that has what looks like a bib on the front is, I don't, I don't know if that's uh, what everyone calls them, but in the Midwest that's what we call them. So they're bibs. These are the Vertex bib. They are in the 5XL in the 29 inch inseam, which is their short inseam. I will say that I felt like these were just a little bit too short in the crotch for me. I am like right in between a short and a regular um, for my sizing. Uh, shorts will always hit me like perfectly and then the regulars almost always like bunch just a little bit so I can wear either. These fit me beautifully over my midsection on top. I was able to adjust the straps and make them even more comfy. These are shockingly comfortable. I have always looked at like snow pants and thought no. I, there's no way I could move in those. I can't wear those. I had to ask my sister what the hell you're supposed to wear under these clothes. And she was like, you know, thermals or leggings or something like that. So I tried everything on with leggings and a t-shirt on so that you guys could see how everything fit over a layer of clothing because the presumption is that if you're wearing bibs, 
it is very cold outside and you want to be warm so you have that bottom layer on. They fit perfectly over my leggings. I, I just feel like a kid in these. I feel like I am in the movie A Christmas Story and I'm with my brother Ralphie and I'm running around. It's very, I feel very nostalgic and cute. I think that's probably because I haven't played in the snow since I was a little kid and able to actually buy snow clothes. The other set of bibs that I got are the Overland bib. These are also in 5X in short. They are comfy and you can see I adjust the straps while I'm doing it. They also have on the sides, they have like this rib knit that stretches. These are, I, I'm just a fan of bibs. Honestly, I think that it's a cool idea that you don't have to worry about your pants falling down while running around in the snow. That feels very nice to me. Uh, all of them, of course, have pockets um, with fleece lining. There's like, this fleece liner is so soft, so nice. The next jacket that I tried on is in this mulberry color. It's called Aspen's Calling. I did try this on in a 5X as well. For many of the jackets that I tried on, I felt like if I were doing outdoor sports and I knew that I needed to put like big um, sweaters and multiple layers under them, I would order them in a 5X. But for some of them, I felt like I could definitely do with a 4X and didn't need the extra space. I am a size 28, generally 26, 28, 26 usually on top, 28 on the bottom. So I felt like I was kind of hovering between the four and five X line. Definitely five X for the bulkier coats, but then for the thinner coats that I'll show you, I think I could have leaned more toward a four X. Everything is like so well made and you can unzip and rezip everything on. It feels like these are really made to be functional for many different types of outdoor wear. The next jacket that I got is their soft shell jacket. It is also in a 5X and it's in the robin blue color. This jacket is just a nice lightweight fleece line jacket. It feels comfy on. This is the kind of jacket I would reach for in the fall when I'm like walking the dogs and need a jacket but also know that as I get active I'm gonna warm up a little bit and I don't want like the bulky huge jacket on. This is perfect for that. The black jacket that I tried on is the soft shell jacket as well. I'm, I need to check the differences in these. I think that the, the other, the robin blue one doesn't have the detachable hood and this one does. And I think that this one might be a little bit longer. So there are different variations of that soft shell jacket. This is the same kind of material that I would reach for if I was walking the dogs in the fall or something. This is just a good midweek jacket. It also has the fleece lining um, and it's in the 5X as well. I saved my favorites for last because you can probably see on the try on videos that these just like made me very very happy. I have been looking for a long puffy jacket that fit me well for a couple years and I just haven't found what I want yet. Um, I didn't want like a gigantic puff. I wanted a mid puff and I wanted it to be long. I really want to be able to wear this and not worry about it bunching in the car. I want to be able to sit on my jacket almost like it's a dress and this is perfect. This green jacket is absolutely everything I have been looking for in my winter jacket. I'm very excited about it. It's called the Savvy it is in, they call this color green gray, and it is also in the 5XL. I love this jacket. I cannot wait to wear this jacket all season long. And the color is so pretty. I really like this color. I feel like this greeny gray color goes with absolutely everything. There's nothing that I can't wear with this. Okay, this is like my, my, my kiddo, like healing my inner child level winter stuff. Uh, these little pants, I mean, they ain't little. They're, they're 5X, they're, they're big girl pants. They are called the Trax pants. They are in the 5X short. I do think that these are just a little bit short on me, but I want to be a snow bunny in these. They are so cute. They have the adjustable pant that expands for your 
snow boots. That is so cute. I put those white pants on with the moonlight jacket. This is also in 5X and it is the baby blue, heather gray, and white. And I put these on together and sign me up for Real Housewives of Salt Lake City, y'all. I'm ready. I am ready to be a snow bunny housewife who knows how to do literally anything in the snow, even if it's just you know, drink warm cider while watching other people be in the snow. I love this. I love this. It makes me want to buy snow boots. It makes me want to hang out in the snow. It is, it, it is perspective shifting. I know that probably feels very dramatic and silly, but it is healing. It's really, really, really nice to be able to buy something that you haven't been able to buy for years and years and to feel like maybe you could be cute along with everyone else who's being cute. These made me feel really positive and just really good and, you know, made, made little baby Coco feel like maybe she will go sledding with her niece and nephew this year, which is pretty nice. The thing about outerwear is that it can be pretty pricey, so there is a discount code below that Snow Country Outerwear is offering all Fat Girl Flow viewers, and you can use that on your first purchase. I know that it's still warm outside, but we all have to prep, you know? We gotta get ready. Winter is uh, coming. I wish I hadn't said that. Let me know what your favorite coat piece of outerwear was in the comments below. Let me know if you feel the same way about wearing things for the snow. If you have felt a little bit left out of cute coats and being able to do winter things because you didn't have the right gear. And check out the blog post at fatgirlflow.com. It is also linked below. Uh, until next time, I'll see you then. Bye! <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.